In favor of an aging gas tax, the state of Washington is getting closer to charging drivers for every mile they drive. This is a controversial issue. It has been studied for a decade now. As King 5's Drew Mickelson reports tonight, legislators may soon begin transitioning away from a 100-year-old tradition. 1921, that's when the Washington State Legislature first created a gas tax to pay for roads in the state of Washington. And when they return here next year, legislators could establish a new system charging you for every mile you drive. The gas tax just doesn't make the state as much as it used to. Cars are getting more efficient and more drivers don't even need to fill up anymore. So since 2012, the state has been looking at the pay-by-mile system. The state refers to it as a road usage charge. The state's Transportation Commission is going to recommend lawmakers offer the program first voluntarily to drivers starting in 2025 and then mandatory for all cars made after 2028. Drivers would be charged 2.5 cents a mile, but only those driven on public roads. And it would not be an additional tax. This would be instead of a gas tax. Drivers would be refunded for any gas taxes paid. Drivers would have an option of having their mileage tracked by regular odometer checks or by a GPS device, which the state knows would cause privacy concerns, but there could be savings there as well. It's going to allow them to not uh, pay road charges on what we call exempt miles, which would be off of our public roadways, so in a neighborhood. Um, around a parking lot <laughs> or if you're on a farm. The Transportation Commission says the current system, the gas tax, benefits those who have cars that get better mileage. Those are usually more expensive cars, more wealthy drivers. So those commissioners will be lobbying legislators here that this new system, the pay by mile, would be a more equitable system. In Olympia, Drew Mickelson, King 5 News.